everybody, this is Matt Tomato here, and welcome back to Age of Empires 2. And so today I'm going to bring you a 2 vs 2. So I've bought you a 2 vs 2 already, but now I'm going to bring you another one. <coughs> so, I have me over here playing in yellow. Uh, I'm playing as the Celts. And so I'm looking to get those early researchers in, the forging the scale mail armor for these Wode Raider. Uh, very decent attack, actually. However, not very good PS armor or anything like that. So that's me playing as the Celts. My teammate is down here. It's Flan5 playing as the Teutons with these awesomely powerful Teutonic Knights uh, with their 17 attack and huge melee armor. Our opponents, Will Redbeard, playing as the Chinese over to this side in blue. Uh, with these Chuko News, might be able to do some damage to these uh, Teutonic Knights, because not the best in Pierce armor. And his teammate uh, is OZ, OSZ Milo 1905 I'll just call him Milo for the moment. Uh, my very good friend Milo, uh, who is playing as the Joss. Uh, very interesting, actually. Um, the Chitonic Knight will definitely take on the Goths pretty well, uh, they probably own them up quite nicely. Uh, and I reckon the Celtic Wild Raider might be able to do a decent job as well, because uh, they have the better attack. Of course the Goths don't really have good uh, melee armor, they have good pierce armor, but they have pretty good melee armor. And straight away we're starting to see this a little bit more, um, my guy is starting to push in rather nicely here. Uh, a few gates on fire, of course, for the Goths, uh, who don't get fortified walls. So the Goths do not get full five walls. So, starting to set some of these gates on fire right now. Meanwhile down here, what's going on? Uh, these two Tonk Knights starting to get pretty owned uh, by these Chico New at the moment, and Will Redbeard managing to defend Flan, hold off Flan 5 quite well. However, over here, me managing to knock down two gates already, and get two villagers already, and sending in saboteurs already. This is great progress from me right here. Really starting to push in, and these saboteurs going to the gates. Uh, we'll probably go to the tower over here, actually. Yep, doing that right now. Boom, straight in there. And another whole load of saboteurs and villagers. Plus, 100 kills equals castle age. Iron casting and chainmail armor on their way. And the villagers starting to build some stables. That's a little bit interesting. Uh, more villagers over here. Uh, some Teutonic Knights coming in from Flan. Just a few just to get this gate. Uh, just to continually attack that while I continue to hold off uh, elite host girls from um, Milo right now. What's going on down here? A lot of Teutonic Knights down here for uh, Flan 5 pushing forward trying to attack the uh, gate of Will Redbeard who is defending quite well actually with his Chico Nu. At the moment is being taken out of the game quite a lot. He's not really been able to do much. Uh, not really able to do much to help his teammates, certainly. Right, in the meantime, these two foot knights over here. Um, just attacking pieces of wall. This saboteur getting in there, and a great shot on there. Another tower is down. And another set of saboteurs and villagers for me. There's a sub standing out here. Uh, I thought about sending it in, but I don't think there's enough away raiders here to be able to do so. Oh, oh no, here it, in it comes, in it comes. Uh, potentially going after this accursed tower. Yep, taking a whole load of hit points out of that. Could have potentially attacked the castle over there, actually. Uh, the Wode Raider not particularly effective, but starting to put this castle on fire. More Wode Raiders coming in. Some Teutonic Knights from the land as well. Uh, starting to take out some of these towers. Uh, While continually trying to push in here, he's broken down his gate. And is starting to take out some of the... Um, some of the units of Will Redbeard, who is now pushing out with some Chico News. Uh, in the meantime, me just continuously moving forward with these Wood Road Raiders, causing a hell of a lot of havoc. Uh, Flan 5, doing a decent job down here, it's still feudal of course. However, Will Redbeard is moving in with some Chico News to help out his teammate, because this pressure is quite something else. That saboteur getting in there, taking out a massive chunk of health from that castle. However, these two Konu are going to make a difference. Void Raiders have pretty bad pierce armor. So these two Konu are going to be able to cut through my guys quite quickly. And this little force of uh, two point knights is probably not going to help that much. Ram going in for me, very interesting. Uh, that's going to get cut down before it does anything. And some more Void Raiders coming in from me. Another battering ram, keeping up the pressure. Mortal Skull here, and now Imperial Age. Very interesting. Again, this battering ram is not going to do much. 
Well, we're providing a little bit of decoy, actually. Um, these Wide Raiders continuously trying to attack. And this round might actually get in. Yep, this round is going to get in. Going to get some shots away. Very interesting. Is it going to go for the castle or is it going to go directly for... Yeah, it's going for the castle. What's going on down here? Uh, Nilo pushing out with some uh, Huskals to try and dis distract my attention. And now all of my Wode Raiders have been killed off in the... Uh, in uh, Milo's base. More Wode Raiders coming in. Still only plus two attack. I don't think we get Blast Furnace. I'm not entirely sure. Ah, oh, yes we do. Blast Furnace. We do get Blast Furnace uh, as the Celts. So that's going to be extra attack. And some Knights starting to come out. Cavalier, of course, uh, is a possible research. Uh, battering Ram, the Cavaliers at the moment. Uh, but one thing that the Celts do get is the Paladin research. Celts do get Paladin, and Paladin will cut through these Huskars even more. Uh, so that's going to be very interesting. However, there is a lot of Elite Chupo news here from Will Redbeard. However, what that does mean is Plan 5, out of this corner, is able to push in big time with these Teutonic Knights. And Will Redbeard decides to king, because that was a hell of a lot of Teutonic Knights right there. These rams not really doing much anymore because these Huskars have now been uh, massed up quite well, actually. Uh, these Chico News from Will Redbeard managing to uh, hold my guys off quite well and basically allowing Milo to mass up more Huskars. Uh, problem over here! Milo attacking this gate! Uh, that's not very good. Uh, I really need to not lose that gate if at all possible. Looks like I am going to lose it though. Especially with these Huskars coming in. Bad. Yep, I have lost that gate. And that is pretty bad because that means villagers for Milo. He's managed to get the villagers. Ram moving out, very interestingly. And a mass of paladins. Gonna push out with these guys now. Gonna see what kind of damage we can cause. These villagers, one villager repairing the accursed tower. The other one is building another watchtower. Very interesting. But look at all these guys. These Paladins coming in. Uh, don't have much Pierce armor, unfortunately, because you don't get the plate barring armor as the Celts. Uh, Nilo actually using his Saboteur uh, to take out that army of Paladins. However, more on the way, and Siege Rams as well for me. So, really starting to mass up uh, some pretty beasty units. In the meantime, uh, Plan 5 continuously pushing forward over this way. Uh, rather interesting, the chasing Milo down. With these guys, that's pretty hilarious, that actually. And now another force for me. The boy raiders coming in. The Rams coming in. Paladin coming in. This could be quite, uh, quite messy. We'll take out these super news. Uh, yeah, my guys are going to have a good time. Uh, certainly the boy raiders are going to have a good time. Uh, continuously trying to attack this castle. This villager is repairing it. Get rid of the villager, for God's sake. Get rid of the villager. Oh, it's managed to... Oh, dear, oh, dear. However, me managing to cut through a hell of a lot of units right there. Uh, these siege rounds not really getting anywhere. There you Alright, sorry about that. And this villager is standing here. So can get rid of it. More paladins coming in. Me flashing. Need help. Plan 5 was to push in with this lot, that would be the end of Milo, that would definitely be the end. If he was to push in with this lot, but as, as it happens he hasn't. Is he moving up? Yes, he's moving up with this force right now. Just need to keep up this attack for a little bit longer. And then the Teutonic Knights will be coming in and absolutely destroying everything. Siege Rams getting in there on that castle, but this villager is still repairing it. Am I going to get it? Yes! One castle down. These paladins doing their best to protect the castles. Uh, to protect the siege ram, sorry. Really getting in some good shots on this castle now. Second castle, losing hit points fast. However, I've run out of paladins. And uh, I'm not going to be able to defend that siege ram much longer. All siege rams coming in. But this is awesome. Uh, Flan 5 pushing in with some Teutonic Knights. Will Redbeard has resigned, so Flan 5 must have done some decent attacking down there. So now it's 2v1 on Milo. He's going to lose this castle. More Paladins coming in from me. And this is surely the end. And there we go. Milo sensibly resigning right there because there was just so much coming into his base.
fantastic game. Uh, Plan 5, of course, great friend of mine. Uh, Milo as well, good friend of mine as well. Uh, very good. Uh, Milo, I believe, is from Turkey. Plan 5, either Ecuador or Colombia, I can't remember. Anyway, um, fantastic game. Uh, good win for me. Good win for Plan 5. Uh, well uh, fought by Milo, actually. He fought off these paladins uh, quite well. But in the end, it was just a little bit too much. Uh, so that's it for now. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time for Age of Empires 2 Online with me, Matt Little Marto.